Hi, I'm Leo, and this is a QBeat Ball. <laughs> This porcelain doll was made by Rose O'Neill and their first appearance was in December 1909 on the pages of Ladies Home Journal. They were first drawn to accompany Bible verses but quickly took on a life of their own with their quirky Cupid with a K style. Even though the Cupids might look mischievous, they were depicted as guardian angels in O'Neill's illustrations. Rose O'Neill said that Cupids get themselves into trouble but Cupids get themselves out. In 1912, the first QP cutout doll appeared in Women's Home Companion. The cutouts were so popular that the same year the first bisque porcelain dolls were made in Germany. They became a massive hit despite the company's halting production in mid-1910 due to World War I. These dolls have influenced many we see today, such as the Sony Angel collectibles. This doll would have been a collectible for women and a toy for young girls. I love these dolls because I own many collectibles, so to be able to see where some of my favorite dolls got their inspiration is pretty cool.